Every day is an air quality alert day or ozone action day in the most polluted city in the world, where it looks like this. <coughs> Ew. I'm storm Tribune meteorologist Jason Myers, and I know what you're thinking. Why is this weather weenie talking to us about pollution? Get off your green hippie save the planet soapbox and just give us the weather. Well, it turns out the weather plays a big part in air quality. That's why the National Weather Service themselves have an air quality alert and an air stagnation advisory. But what do these mean? Air quality alerts are issued when ground level ozone, particle pollution, or certain gases are in especially high concentrations. Still wondering what this has to do with our weather? Ozone forms near the surface when pollution from cars and factories mixes with heat and sunlight. Air stagnation advisories are issued when there are major buildups of air pollution, smoke, dust, or industrial gases are expected near the ground. This can happen when a lazy high pressure system with no wind just sits over one area for days at a time. So what can you do so we see fewer of these alerts? Walk, bicycle, carpool, or take public transportation instead of driving all by yourself. Turn off lights when you don't need them. Cut back on heating and cooling when you can. Buy Energy Star appliances when you're shopping for a new one. Do this and we'll have more of those nice weather days ahead of us in the future. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.